welcome to NCA Channel 12 News for the Deaf. My name is Sheyi Ogumbayo. The House of Representatives has pledged its support for press freedom, acknowledging the Nigerian media as one of the most vibrant institutions in the country. In a statement commemorating this year's World Press Freedom Day, spokesman of the House, Akin Rotimi, says the Green Chamber will champion legislation towards reviewing laws and practices that restrict press freedom and the ability of the media to carry out their constitutional role. The House calls on journalists and media practitioners in the country to uphold responsible use of digital media and pursue facts-based journalism to help protect democracy in Nigeria. Similarly, domesticating the Freedom of Information Act will further enhance governance and strengthen information gathering in Akwa Ibom State. This is coming as journalists in the states observe the 2024 World Press Freedom Day through cultural diversity. On labor matters, the Nigerian Labor Congress says its demand for 615,000 minimum wage is a product of a painstaking effort through which it captured the cost of living of Nigerian workers and masses in all parts of the country. A statement by the president of the NLC, Joe Ajeru, explains that the research was based on a family with both parents alive and four children without the burden of having other dependents with them. He noted that questionnaires were designed and sent to all the state councils of NLC and CUC. From where these, they were sent to NLC and CUC members in all the local government areas in the country to gather the monthly cost of living for the average family. Meanwhile, the Nigeria Governors Forum has pledged to sustain negotiations and leverage available fiscal infrastructure in improving workers' welfare. This formed major resolutions of the forum at the end of its virtual monthly meeting held on Wednesday, 1st of May, 2024. In Ogun State, a bill to domesticate the Nigeria Consumer Protection Law has passed second reading at the Ogun State House of Assembly with members embracing the components of the bill for adequate protection of consumers against harmful and sharp practices from service providers. The lawmakers also adopted a re resolution advocating the urgent need to tackle causism and the appointment of Commissioner for Youth in Ogo State. Autistic children and adults are outstanding in their pleas of strength and interest being intentional in providing special support for persons with this spectrum from childhood to adulthood thrive in the, their individual interest field. Guests on Good Morning Nigeria believe is a game changer in harnessing their tremendous potentials. And that's the size of our package for this week. Join us next week for another edition of News for the Deaf. Good night.